And I'm Tracy Bingham. And you guys are both on Baywatch, right? Yes. Okay. And you know what you're doing here today? Yes. Yes. What's that? We're playing Jeopardy with Howard and David Brenner and Robin. How do you think you guys are going to do? We're going to kick ass. Gonna Can kick I say butt. that on TV? Yeah. <laughs> A lot of people tend to say, like, really good-looking girls aren't that smart. That's a myth. That's a myth? That's a myth. Not with us two. Because <laughs> Jeopardy, Jeopardy is pretty hard. Yeah, Jeopardy, good job. Jeopardy is uh, very hard, but I'm, I'm actually want to talk to Gary to sort of hit him up for the answers, because I know that Howard's probably plotting to make the answers um, difficult. I'm sure the answers are uh, questions that, uh, that nobody knows. Nobody can answer. <laughs> oh, you think they're a lot harder than they should be? Like, things that you'll never answer? Well, sometimes they are. But then sometimes they're really easy. Well, they're, prob they're probably middle of the road, asking. I would think. I would think they're middle of the road. Mm, we'll see. So, David. Yes. So you, so you know what you're here for today, right? Yes. What is that? I'm playing Jeopardy with uh, two of the women from Baywatch and Robin. Now, how do you think you're going to do? I think I'm going to do horribly because I'm, I'm terrible with trivia and I can't remember people's names. I think that's a big disadvantage. I, should, I think I should get a handicap. You think they should add points to you? Absolutely. I, th I should get a handicap. I'm, I'm an inferior player. Uh, and you know, why shouldn't I get some, some kind of advantage? Do you feel that you're good in any category, maybe? I mean, is there anything that you might be If it has to do, yeah, maybe with my life, I might get some question, you know, questions, right, if it talks about my life. A comedy, got a shot at that. Right. A little bit of TV, certain TV. Talk show TV. Right. Uh, Howard Stern. Howard Stern show. That the Howard Stern Empire. So if there's none of those, then you're out of luck. I'm in trouble. I just don't remember names, and I'm not a trivia guy. I, I don't care what happened. <laughs> Anywhere, anytime, to anyone. I don't care. All right, so your prediction. Who do you think is going to win today? I think Robin's going to walk away with it. Think I think, yeah, oh, yeah, I think it's going to be a walk away. I think, matter of fact, I think they brought me in here for the simple purpose. They know what a dunce I am when it comes to this. So you think, I'm a setup. You think you're here to boost Robin's ego? Yeah, well, I don't know if it's a booster ego, but it's definitely to give her a win. I mean, it couldn't have picked a better person, worse at the game. <laughs> <laughs> David Brenner and two broads from Baywatch are coming in to play. Uh, Let's be nice. We haven't met them yet, and we still want them to come in. Oh, you think I was too mean to David Brenner? <laughs> no. <laughs> no, to the two girls? Yeah. They're hot, man. I definitely want to meet them. Two lovely Baywatch beauties. Yeah. Oh, I love Baywatch girls, man. I feel like the luckiest man in the world when I can meet <laughs> Tracy Bingham and Marlise Andrada. What a name. Yeah. Marlise Andrada is the Playboy centerfold this month as well. Oh, yeah? Yeah, that's kind of neat. What so, are her likes and dislikes? We ought to read that. <laughs> Let me see. Here, here's her likes. And First of all, she was born... 1972. Wow, that's amazing. Yeah. I there were still people being born after we were born. <laughs> I was going into college in 1972. I know. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Turn-ons. Mystery. I love getting to know a man and discovering all the nuances that make him special. Turn-offs. Bad breath. Oh, poor Jackie. <laughs> uh oh Bad jokes. Oh, oh poor, poor Jackie. Jackie. <laughs> and being hit on at the gym. Hmm. Yeah. Well, Jackie won't hit on her there. <laughs> <It's> <laughs> yeah. <safe> for me. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, how to win her heart. Be honest. Be easygoing. I'm a vegetarian, so yeah. an authentic vegetarian Italian meal made by my man wouldn't hurt. Oh, I'll do that. <laughs> yeah. Give me some of this, man. I'll definitely cook up a, uh, a yeah, vegetarian you, you meal. Whip something up, huh? Yeah. She says any woman, no matter what size or shape, can be sexy if she believes she is. I, I disagree with that. I think you need to look really hot to be sexy. Oh, no, you don't. Oh, yes, you do. No, you don't. <laughs> Trust me. <laughs> Let's bring everybody in, okay? I'll give you a little uh, practice round. I can't believe it. Uh, I, oh, yeah, I love Baywatch broads. Oh, my God, look at that. Oh, yeah. What a mistake bringing David Brenner in with the Baywatch girls, because he gets enough good-looking poonage. <laughs> hey, Tracy. Hey, Marlies. Hey, David. Hey. Good seeing you. Oh, yeah. Hi. This is uh, Marlies Andrada. Wow. That's very good. Marlies is the current Cernifold and Playboy. Yeah. Now, didn't she get in trouble? I thought there was a whole plot line on Baywatch about one of the girls doing a Playboy shoot. Uh, yeah. How come the how come the lifeguard? I don't understand the plot to Baywatch sometimes. Hi, Tracy. How are you? <laughs> Good. How are you? Good to speak to you. You have to watch every show. Uh, how come? Like why? Like why? If you're a lifeguard, can't you be a playmate? Playmate. 
Like, why did the Baywatch girls get in trouble for that? It was just a storyline that that when Donna did that, lifeguards aren't supposed to pose in the nude. Really? <laughs> you think lifeguards would be allowed? You think some occupations you'd be allowed, David Brown? That was I, I, think, I think every occupation except the presidency should be allowed to pose in the nude. Yeah, right. And David, you get a, you, David Brenner, by the way, gets enough good-looking girls to well, choke a anymore. horse. Well, not anymore. He sort of settled down. No, he settled, settled down. down. I'm a retired man. Yeah, he gets tons of girls. This would have been a perfect day for me in the past. <laughs> yeah, I know. Oh now you don't God. even act on this. It's kind of no, weird no, seeing you I'm all just, pussy very, whipped. Yeah, I'm very polite. I just oh. talk. I'm very... No yeah, hitting. I didn't hit on him anything. I would right? love to go out with these two girls. Move. I would love to go out with Marlies and Tracy. I really would. Who wouldn't? No, yeah. who wouldn't? I really need that. Well, we'd I love to go out with you, too. Really? Is that true, Marlies? Oh, yeah. <laughs> we love you. Really? You're the best, really? Howard. You are. You're absolutely amazing. Amazing really? person. Yeah. yeah. Now, they never said that to you when you were single. They no. Saw you, Howard. You <laughs> David Brennan's like, you yeah. stupid ass. Oh, you <laughs> dumb ass. Oh, you have a chance. Oh, man. <laughs> I wonder if I was single, would you really go out with me, though? I really wonder if we could go out on a date or would you definitely we, we really like, oh yeah how about if we worked at 7-eleven <laughs> hey tracy it says in your uh, oh no forget that <laughs> right? tracy it says in your bio you're black you're white and you're also indian and uh what else are you you're like, cherokee cherokee, wow. cherokee she's indian? like Cobblin asian right <laughs> yeah every black chick i meet is cherokee indian i can't believe it <laughs> and italian too well, yeah geez well, what do you mean your father was what he was black. A, he was a black, black guy. Black Indian, yes. He was a black Indian. Uh-huh. Oh, black man. and Indian. Talk about having two strikes against you. <laughs> <laughs> black and I'm an Indian. Right. Yeah, well, that's pretty... You might as well just go drink right now. You can't live anywhere in America, right? No. Oh, please. I've hated everywhere. I've hated, hated everywhere. So your dad was a black Indian. He was he's African-American and Indian. Right. Yes. And uh, he meets your mom, who is what? Yes, who's black. Who's black yes. and Italian? Yes. No, she's black. My father, she's got a little, little, little bit of Italian. A little bit yeah. of Italian. Yes, uh-huh. I wonder where all, how did he Wait get Wait a it? minute. Yeah, it's unbelievable. How many parents did he have? Yeah, your father really gets around, I tell you. My father was one of ten. My father, very big family. Right. My mom's an only child. Right. Wow. Yeah. And I'm the youngest of seven. I've got two older, uh, four older brothers. And hey, Robin. Yes. I met Robin before. Really? Where? Fresh Prince, Fresh Prince of Bel Air. Really? Yeah. Oh, you did that show? Yes, yes. And I walked up to Robin. and I said, "I think you're fantastic on Howard." And did you ever bang Will Smith? <laughs> <laughs> well, <laughs> yeah, you did, huh? You no, did, no, didn't no, no. you? No, no. I you didn't. bet you did. <laughs> you foxy devil. You. Did you have sex with Will Smith? No, I he should not. he should marry you instead of that other girl, oh, yeah. Jada Pink. Yeah, you're much hotter than her. So uh, actually, it's not uncommon to meet a lot of people who are black and Indian at the same time. Is that right? Yeah, I knew a guy in in uh, high school who was black and Indian. Mm-hmm. Used to steal whiskey all the time. Oh. It's unbelievable. Uh. <laughs> they threw him out of school. How are you bad? I'm just kidding around, of course. <laughs> I love everybody. <laughs> And Marlise, you're in uh, Playboy. I am. And uh, no black. You are no. Very, there's no black in you. Indian. Very little Indian. Very little Indian. Indian. <laughs> David Brenner's part black and Indian also. I'm no. totally black. Oh, you are black. Yes, I'm. To- I'm a black man. Yeah, I thought you were. <laughs> Marlise is white and white. She's oh. very white. Actually, yeah. my last name is Portuguese. Is that right? Mm-hmm. Marlise, how do you how do you pronounce your last name? Am I saying it right? Andrada. Andrada. Mm-hmm. Oh, okay, I'm saying yeah, it properly. That's right. Very yeah, good. You, you girls going out with any celebrities or anything? I mean, in the old days you would have been with David Brenner, but he's retired now. <laughs> <laughs> he's off the circuit. I yeah. hung it up. Yeah, but uh, you going out with anybody famous, Marlise? No, I'm not. Really, you never have? No. I don't believe that. No. Tracy, what about you? Did you ever go out with someone famous? I uh, know, haven't. Haven't dated anybody famous? No. no. I mean, I've, I've gone out. But not Had a good committed. Time. Yeah, like yeah. who'd you go out who'd you go with? Out yeah, with? just you know, well, Stallone. Marky Mark. Marky Mark. Matt oh, Damon. That's a good-looking guy. Matt Damon. Matt Damon. Matt Damon. Yeah. Yeah. We went to the same school together. You didn't do oh, anything yeah. to Matt, Matt Damon. Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> you did, didn't you? I'll let him tell you that. <laughs> did you do a Monica Lewinsky on him? Oh, yeah, sure. <laughs> I bet you're good at that. Mm, yeah, I bet. You know, it's funny. David Brenner in the old days would be going out with these girls. Now it's like yeah. he's gay. He's just sitting there, like you know. I feel gay. I know. What happened to you? It's over. I It's horrible. Well, no. Because Robin's yeah. going to sit there for the big game. We're gonna, you're going to help Robin prepare for a Jeopardy match. Do you I hope remember you guys what it was like, David? Or yeah, is because it... I would, you know, the centerfold. Mm. I would see a centerfold, and I, I contact and I take him out. I know. Now really? you don't do anything. Now, now I'm thinking, geez, I better not even look at her in the centerfold because I I'm haven't gotten a person. single phone call. Really? Look at this. <laughs> there, you know something? I retired, and there are only schmucks left. <laughs> yeah, is, you were the last good guy field. left. It's an open field, and nobody knows what to do. David, you ever watch Baywatch? No, but I've seen parts of it while I've been channel surfing. Here's some of my favorite uh, episodes. Ralph, Ralph watches Baywatch like a retard, right? Yeah, he does. And help me out with some of these because I'm just reading it off the piece of paper here, all right? Here it is. Here's a great one. Rookie of the Year. 
Uh, Summer and Matt, this is before you girls were in it. Summer and Matt face grueling personal and physical challenges in rookie school, the boot camp of lifeguarding, while CJ and Stephanie are forced to share an apartment. Oh, wow. Yeah. <laughs> That's pretty good. Those episodes are great because they always end up fighting and running around in towels, you know? Yeah, who's on the show Ooh, now? When they're well, living you, together. Uh, There's you, a lot of cast there members so here. so many new girls. Of, uh, and what, what, Yasmin Bleeth thinks she's too good to be on Baywatch? What is she, <laughs> what, is she drinking? <laughs> what is she, uh, what, is she? Is she on the reservation or something? Did she see what happened to, what's that, Samantha... Nicole Eggert. Yeah, Nicole Eggert. Yeah. I went out to dinner with her. Uh, that's when I had that bad uh, experience really, with marijuana. Yeah, <laughs> but I, I, was at di- I think I was at dinner with her. No, I decided I needed to smoke marijuana to relax. Yeah, yeah. And I smoked like three hits. And uh, Nicole was there and a couple other people. And I figured, wow, this is going to be a great night. Beautiful women. Me, the toast of Hollywood. I, I bummed out. I couldn't talk. I can't smoke pot. Yeah. I just can't do it. I don't know what happened. I just no, freaked out. Well, you got I've bad pot. I've never smoked pot. Ever. You never? Really, Marlies? Never. Oh, I've never done yeah. anything. Really? Anal sex? Yeah. Uh, no. You've never tried that? Not yet. Uh, hey, Howard. If you were my girl, you'd have to... I'd have to turn that on. Would She's I? not going to fess up to anything because her mom's in the, the green room. Right oh, is that right? <laughs> <laughs> you girl, I've never you, smoked marijuana. <laughs> but you girls have breast implants, or are these the are these big breasts yours? It's a real thing, baby. Smart. Get out, Marley's yeah. true. <laughs> true. Get you out. Can look at my layout. You can tell. Let me see that. You can tell. Totally Whoa! Tell. Didn't you think those were fake, David? <laughs> I didn't see, no, I didn't see the layout. It, oh, they right. got to catch them when they're laying down. Oh yeah, they are real. Right? See, all my poses, I have to, you know. I like how you shave, by the way. Oh, I just think you're the cutest, hottest girl in the world, and I would really love to make love to you and treat you right I treat you the way a man should treat I you I believe you and I would really are you worship in, you are you girls involved with people oh well, that's a bad subject oh it you is? are Marlies I have a broken heart oh. what happened who broke up with you your boyfriend um well I ha- I've had a long term boyfriend who was it he, who was it yeah what did he do what did he do for a living uh, he's a fireman fireman a fireman yeah. uh-huh. and well, he broke up with and you and he broke up with you a fireman he must be a Polak well actually it was my doing but. what are you thinking David I can't, I can't believe nah, it she broke up with I mean, him. Nothing to, I'm not putting yeah. down No, fire, she man. broke up. She broke oh, up with I didn't him. want to do it. Oh. I had to. You had to do it because you want to date uh, famous guys. You know, when you get lied to so many times, you can only take it so much. What did he, he lie about? He cheated on you? Was he cheating on you? He cheated on you? Oh, my Get over God. here. Wow. <laughs> Change the subject. You guys are going to make me cry. Come here. My lips are burning. I want to kiss you. <laughs> we can talk about my Playboy layout that's coming out in a couple months. Is that right, Tracy? Uh-huh. Oh, come here, baby. Do you have a boyfriend? <laughs> yes, I actually do. Who is your boyfriend? His name is Rob. White guy? Yeah. Oh, no kidding. How did you know that? You dig white guys? Uh huh. So your kids are I'm going as to white as they come. They, what else is he beside white? What? I want to know what her children are going to be. He's Cherokee and French. <laughs> He's Polish. I mean, He's what is he? What does he do for a living? He's a musician. Boyfriend? Oh, yeah, in a rock band, huh? Yeah, yeah your typical Baywatch. Yeah. I knew it. Uh, Howard, what? you know, I always see Tracy in these, like, uh, Entertainment uh, weekly reports and stuff like that. She's been at part. Like she's a party girl. She's always out. <laughs> oh yeah. Yeah. She's fun. I'm gonna yeah, squeeze your ass. Your scores. What Would is you? Oh, yeah, those oh, uh, right. are those implants on you? No. Oh, tell the truth. No, I'm I, telling the truth. Let me see. Well, wh- what? What do you want me to do? Pull, pull up your shirt and let me take a look at it. <laughs> oh, you are unbelievable, the two of you. The two of you together. Did two of you ever kiss each other? Oh. Yeah, no, yeah. Yeah. Ever, yeah. Haven't yet. You never had a lesbian sex, either one of you? Uh, no. no. Tracy, come on. You've had it. No. no. Don't, no. If you're a party girl, you've had it. <laughs> Although we were waiting in the green room for quite a while. We were contemplating. Right. Tracy, how old were you when you lost your virginity? How old was I? Yeah. Gosh, I think I was I think I was 16. 16, 16. years old. Yeah. Oh man. What a late starter. Uh-huh. <laughs> Marlies, what about you? Howard, my mom is in the other room. Is your mom as hot as you cuz I'll jump on top of both yeah. of you. My mom is hot. <laughs> she is hot. How does she feel about you being a playboy? She don't care. She, no, she's proud of me. Yeah, I'm proud of Very you. Very proud of me. I'd like to meet your mom. <laughs> I'd like to meet the woman that gave birth to you. <laughs> <laughs> That's so sexy that you came out of her private parts. <laughs> You know what I mean? It's yeah. so dirty. <laughs> it's so she dirty. She's just like me. Yeah. I look uh, just like her. Here's another uh, Baywatch plot. I love this one. Okay? Uh, a chilling assassination plot finds CJ unconscious on a dynamite-laden scarab heading for a crowded pier. Wait a minute. Whoa. Ray, 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 Ray. All right. So Pamela Anderson is unconscious <laughs> on a boat, and it's, it's laden with dynamite. And it's headed for a crowded pier. She's oh. being assassinated? I thought yeah. assassination had to do with political... Uh... No. They're going <laughs> to blow her up. They, were, they weren't that. assassinating her. She she kind of foiled it and then like got knocked out oh, on the boat. I and... see. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Typical day at the beach. That's I love perfectly it. perfectly normal. What's yeah. the best see, one you've been in this year? Are there any cool plots? I saw one with Tracy I, uh, last week. What was she, that? She met her long-lost mom, Mother. who was white. <laughs> yeah. And who was it? Like Valerie Harper or no, somebody? No, it was um, uh, Marsha Strassman, who was on Welcome Back Carter. Yeah. 
Dave's wife. Oh, looking wife. really bad. And you, and all of a sudden you had a white mom? <laughs> yeah, that's the storyline they gave me. Cool. And when she came on set, we looked at each other and started laughing. Because you're not like, <laughs> that's you know, your mother. So funny. Well, how did you like her? your mother? <laughs> Why don't you know who your mother is? I like that. <laughs> Why didn't they use Gabe Kaplan? It's just as ridiculous. Yeah, that would have been better. <laughs> Here's your mother, Gabe <laughs> Kaplan. But, no, but Howard. Hey, have you guys seen Pamela Anderson's home movies? Um, yeah, I saw hot. part of it. Isn't that hot? Yeah, I think oh, it's hot. It I is think, hot. Yeah, she and Tommy Lee make such an awesome couple. Yeah, I mean, that's how we would look together. <laughs> Seriously. Minus Except without minus the schlong. I was going to say, minus the schlong and the tattoos. How many tattoos do I've got some tattoos. i got three. Oh, let me see. Oh, yeah? Yeah, I oh, love like, tattoos. Do you? Oh, nice. <laughs> all right. Well, I'll say mine. Oh, boy. Now Tracy I'm all does excited. As long yeah, as they're in the right I places. Like I got one on my shoulder. Okay. Obviously, they haven't been out with any Jews. That's, That's cool. cool. You like that? That's cool. cool. All right. Jews that's my birth sign. Oh, you look great. I do? You yeah, do. you look really oh, good. really? Yeah. You look just like you do on your uh, po- your poster for your movie. That's right. Exactly. Good. Torture him more. Yeah, right. <laughs> See, I got one on my finger. Very nice. That's a tattoo. Oh, what is that? What is that? What is it's that? What's that symbol? He doesn't know. He just closed his eyes. It stands right. for Tracy. Ooh, <laughs> <an hour. laughs> I got that. And then I got one on the back of my neck. See? Right here. Right there. That is cool. Wow. You I like it on the back so of the neck. I'm like Tommy Lee. I'm telling you. <laughs> <laughs> Can I just tell you my most memorable episode on the show? Go ahead. It's when I get hit in the face <laughs> with a buoy. Oh, right. I had an accident. It's my only plastic surgery I've ever had, actually. It was on my lip. <laughs> You got hit in the face with a buoy while filming? Yes, while filming. 22 stitches. I heard the Baywatch water is disgusting. It's underneath the Santa Monica Pier. They had to give me a tetanus shot. Really? And it's freezing, right? It's totally freezing. Really? It wasn't too cold for me. Yeah. Have you guys scored with any of the guys on the show? Do you guys date any of the guys on the show? (laughs) Ever? (laughs) That's a yes. No, Let's not know. talk about that. So Tracy, you did, huh? Who did you do it with? No, no, actually. Who are you with? David Chokachi? David Chokachi. Have you been with him? No, but we're both from Massachusetts. Have you been with any of the guys on Baywatch? Um, you know what? There's too no. many guys to choose from. They're all so gorgeous. It sounds to me like they have been. I don't know what's going on here. I don't know either. No, we're just all very friendly with each other. All right, here's another great plot. CJ is seduced by a fashion photographer. That's uh, hard to believe. Well, what's funny about those is every week she was seduced by somebody else. Yeah, oh, like a balloonist. Being seduced. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's kind of funny. Those were great. Ones. How's this one? Mitch, that's David Hasselhoff's character, delivers a baby when the mother goes into premature labor while swimming at the beach. Oh, please. he delivers a baby. I saw the one where he performed open heart surgery with a uh, uh, with a pen. Right, where he pulls a bullet out. Swear, yeah, where he pulls a bullet out. He pulled a bullet out. Point. Yeah, with a with a ballpoint pen. Oh man. <laughs> well, he used to be a Navy SEAL, I think it. Here's another one. CJ is enamored with a beach magician. That I can believe. Yeah. See, that's a believable plot. I like that one. Who, who writes this stuff? Here's one. Mitch cures cancer with a popsicle stick. <laughs> <laughs> that's I cool. remember that one. You don't remember yeah. that one? No. I, I love it. Stretching out a bit. Yeah. So how do you get into uh, Baywatch? Like, would you have to do audition or something? Yeah, it's full on, yeah, audition, swim test, screen test. You, you have, have to, to go kiss to a guy it. on camera as a screen test? <laughs> no. <laughs> no. But my first episode, actually, I got to make out with David Chokichi. Oh, did you? I was on an episode before I got on the show, actually, as a regular. Do you get excited when you kiss a guy? Mm-hmm. Oh, you were a mermaid? Mm-hmm. On, on Baywatch? <laughs> on Baywatch, a real mermaid. And then, then you missed that really one. Yeah, where was that one? <laughs> Such a realistic show. <laughs> <laughs> a mermaid. When you, when you, they're real. They really are mermaids. When you kiss a guy on Baywatch, do you get excited? Seriously, do you ever feel like, you know... Well, when it's David Chokichi, who... You did? You do get yeah, excited. Yeah, he's, he's pretty hot. He's yeah? pretty hot. You, that was Michael Bergen. And, yeah. and when you girls kiss on camera sometimes, you actually feel aroused? Well, I think that that's kind of difficult to do when there's a million people standing around you. Mm. Any of those guys pop rods when they uh, <laughs> have a pop a rod? David, you've done love scenes and stuff, right? Yeah, sure. Yeah, I mean, you have a pop a rod in the middle of one? Sure. Yeah, I did. I, I did know, on my I, movie. When I read the script, I pop the rod. <laughs> really? <laughs> then I go, yeah. It's unbelievable. Right he has away. to read it over and over again to get yeah, over. Right, right. I'm right. <laughs> can anybody submit a script for uh, Baywatch? I have a great yes. idea for one, seriously. Yeah, you sure can. Well, they yeah. wrote you into one. You turned it down. I did turn it you down. You did, boy, Howard. Yeah, you know, I'm more of a movie star. Than I am a te- small screen. Star. Your, your, your movie was amazing, by the way, oh, and I've got to be in your next one. Uh, you will be in the I sequel. Loved your movie. You'll be in the sequel as well. We'll have to audition you after we play Jeopardy. And? David, of course. Well, that, that goes and? without saying. That's a, it picks up where I meet David Brenner. What is the swim test they have to do to get into the show? It's you an actual swim, swim test. Tank. Really? Yeah, they want to see what you look like underneath the water, how fast you can swim. Really? Strength, right. the breaststroke, diving, everything. So wow. did you guys know how to swim? Well, yeah, I did. You I was did. on the yeah. swim, swim, swim team in school. Really? But you know what? I didn't know what the strokes were actually called. Yeah. So they, they said, okay, you have to Excuse do this, me. this, this, and this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, sorry. That was me. I'm sorry. Marlissa's actually 
actually, she's really good. We were taking scuba classes together, and she can hold her breath for so long. <laughs> I bet you I can hold my the breath longer. The full length I of have, the pool. I have big lungs. <laughs> really? You do. You have a gorgeous chest. I got to both of you. <laughs> so here's my idea for a story. Check this out. David has written a lot of scripts and stuff. Tell me what you think of this. Okay. okay. Mitch, uh, David Hasselhoff character. Goes to a whorehouse. Yeah. <laughs> That's as far as I got. Oh, yeah. It's right. good. Good. What do you think? Yeah. <laughs> it's a good one, right? Yeah. You tune in for that. Yeah. That's good treatment, right? That's called the treatment. You it's can a, do it to a, be continued. Yeah, no, it's, I just pitched that it's idea. It's on the beach. Right. The whorehouse is on the beach. Yeah, it's a traveling right. whorehouse. Well, yeah, Mitch has to go bust the whorehouse on the beach. Yeah. A floating. I'll make it a floating whorehouse. Yeah. That'd be really good. A barge. A barge yeah. brothel. How much you girls get paid for that? You know that show is on in 185 countries, and it's probably the most popular syndicated show. And right. David Hasselhoff is, one is a billionaire. Show. Yeah, number one watched in the world. But yeah. everyone always, all the chicks leave because they never pay you guys, right? They just have, um, <laughs> they just no. I mean, it's fine. I mean, it's the pay is fine. It's just um, they're always looking for new and different faces. Yeah. Right. How are, are you girls CTs, or do you really put out? Uh, <laughs> what? Are, are you what? CTs, or do you put out? What is a CT? You don't know what a CT is? No. They know. Oh, you know What's what it is. I think you know. What <laughs> CT is. CT is. David, you know what a CT is, right? <laughs> Please. <laughs> Give me a... Give me a you want to know? I have no idea what, you know what? CT is. The C stands for this. Uh-huh. And the teaser. teaser. Oh! <laughs> are you a CT? Or? Got it. Okay. Are you a C-teaser or are you put out? Seriously. When you're with a man, I'm you... I'm neither. Re really? No, I'm just myself. Do you, do you, I'm down to earth. You girls into anal sex at all? Yeah. Are you hard? Yeah, I'm into it. I, I, really? I dabble in it, yeah. You like to watch it or you like to do it? I, I like to have it done to me. <laughs> Ooh, baby. <laughs> David, come over here. <laughs> Let's play prison. Yeah, baby. <laughs> yeah, Jeffrey, I like to get my prison. salad tossed. <laughs> <laughs> I, of course, I like to, uh, I like to conquer, yeah. You like to conquer. Oh, yeah. I like to thoroughly conquer. If my woman doesn't walk out of the room unable to walk, <laughs> then I know that I've not done a good job. All right? I like to conquer and be conquered. Yeah. No. I think that it should be 50-50. Yeah. I like a crippled woman when I'm uh, like, <laughs> I like a wheeled out in a wheelchair. Like my women crawl away from me. Oh, yeah. Wow. It looks like a psycho after she comes out of the shower. <laughs> wow. Like crawling out of it. Oh, yeah. It's very bloody and disgusting. <laughs> Yeah, I'm very. I'm into rough sex, pretty much. Are any of you girls into rough sex? Sure. I know well, David is. Tracy is. Tracy is. Tracy is. I like to grab you by the hair and throw you out a window. <laughs> Howard, you know what's really funny? <laughs> That's rough to you. <laughs> yeah. When, no. when, whenever you ask any, whenever you ask those girls anything, Tracy always goes, hmm, hmm, no. But it's always like it's always a yes first. Oh yeah. <laughs> Last girl I was with, yes. I punched her in the head during anal sex. Oh jeez. That's how rough it got. Okay. Oh, wow. And she liked it. All right. <laughs> okay. Let's play some games, guys. Damn it. Alrighty. All right, girls, David, <laughs> yes. I've called you in today. Robin yes. is going on Jeopardy. Great. Robin uh, is going on Jeopardy. I think that's great. And we're going to have a warm up round. By the way, we have a Hooters girl here. How are you? Hello. Na what's your name? Amanda. Amanda is going to work the board for us. Okay. So every time you pick a category, Amanda will turn it. How's things at Hooters? Great. Fun. You, you know they want guys to be waiters at Hooters? Would you guys like to want to be guys? They don't want to be guys. Guys were suing because they wanted. They thought it was job discrimination. How stupid yeah. is I that? I think if, if a guy has gazooms, he should do it. Right. That's it. <laughs> Otherwise, stay out of the restaurant. Hey, you want to see kidding? a guy in that outfit? No. <laughs> no, not at all. <laughs> idea of Hooters. I mean, what kind of a mind thinks he can get a job as a Hooter? Are there men uh, working at Hooters now? Only in the kitchen. In the kitchen, right. Good. Yeah. Let's keep it that so way. Right. They hey, just by the way, their own restaurant. <laughs> you girls ever work in strip clubs or anything like that? No, but yeah. you know, I really want to see, check out Scores. I'll wanna, take you. I've never been there before. Want to go with me today? I oh my God, I'd love to go. To strip clubs. Really? Yeah. Oh. Seriously. Yeah, Carmen Electra and I were going to go once. Carmen? Yeah. Hey, is she a real CT? Or does she put oh, out? Carmen is it. awesome. Yeah. <laughs> Her breasts aren't real. I don't know if Are you they? know that. I don't know. No, yeah. they're not real. They're not? She did Prince, you know. Oh, yeah, I know. Yeah. How yeah, come I you know. girls never did Prince? <laughs> Actually, you know, I was presenting an award. Taken. What the dealio? I, I saw him at him. He was sitting in the front row. Would, yeah. And I was looking at him for a quick second, and I, I, I was presenting with uh, Jackie Chan. Yeah. And I was just looking at him. The way he was looking at me was really weird. So I got confused. He wanted like, you. <laughs> he's half black and he's half uh, something else. Yum, yum. I think he's Jewish. <laughs> I'm not even sure. David Brenner might have done Prince with his sexual past, I'm telling you. <laughs> I don't know. You know, there have been some nights I just don't know identity. All right. Yeah. <laughs> hey, Rod. Have you tried them? them? What is it? <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh, Tracy? Yes. That, that you offered uh, Keenan Ivory Wayans to fill, fill your breasts and know if they're real. Why don't you offer Howard to? Do you let Keenan Ivory Wayans feel no, your breasts? No, he, he, uh, we were talking about the breast question because when you're in Baywatch, people always ask you that. If so you have fake breasts, yeah. So I said, do, I, I said, yeah, do you want to feel? And he didn't. And then he I, didn't want to feel? I do. Well, he got embarrassed. Well, wait, and then I, he, um, 
I told him that he was cute and that I wanted to kiss him. Yeah, what and about me? I and I licked his head. Did you see that? No. <laughs> I don't watch that show. Nobody does. You're telling me Keenan Ivory Wayne's you would kiss and not me? <laughs> of course I kissed you. Too. I didn't kiss him. I licked He's his head. I licked his bald head. So lick my bald head. <laughs> <laughs> there's, there's a place on my head that's bald. <laughs> oh. I mean, come on. What is this? I don't get it. I can't believe it. <laughs> you don't want to kiss me? I would kiss you, but you're married. Oh. So was Keenan Ivory Wayne. No, he's not. He's, he's, he's living he's, with. He's living with a girl. He had kids. Oh, really? stuff. You told me yeah. you're single. Yeah, yeah right. 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 So am I. I'm as single as he is. That's oh, forget it then. I'm not kissing you. And you're not in my next movie. Oh, Howard, I love you then. Stay on Baywatch. Oh. Help with you. I don't care. All right, listen. Let's take a break. Uh, we'll play Jeopardy with Robin when we get back. A quick round. We'll see how we do. All right. And uh, it'll be fun. We'll just have a good time. They will. All right? Great. All right? Sure. You're up for it, David? Great. Great. All right, good. Yeah. Cool. Great. Okay, right after these words, we'll Great. come back. <laughs> Let me tell everyone who's playing Jeopardy right oh, yeah. now. Okay? We're in the game now? First of all, yeah. David Brenner is finishing up a 10-night sold-out tour at Resorts International Atlantic City. He's having a second Thank kid. Thank you for making it all the way up here. Yes. Yeah, with his current companion. I like that. Yeah. A companion. Yeah, I like that. I like you that. You never figured out that companion thing. I mean, hey, I'm not marrying you. You'll take my money. <laughs> <laughs> Marlies Andrada is, of course, a Baywatch star. She's the current Centerfold in Playboy. Check out her, by the way, nice layout. And she's Thank free. You. And she's, she's free. <laughs> she's going to be down on the uh, stock exchange today. Yeah. You guys better come out and make your plays. I'm, I'm available. I'm not free. Okay. <laughs> All right. That, yeah, trust difference. me, she's there's not free. I bet you it's very expensive. <laughs> you look great. I like you. What are you on? You. A, what are you on? You're shooting outdoors on the beach, right? Right. And some of them were in the studio, and most of them were outside. I like the way you shave, too. Thank you. Like just a little <laughs> landing strip. I'm a real strip. blonde, too. Never, you are real Never blonde. colored my hair. Nice. Everything's God. real except my nails. And your breasts are real. <laughs> my breasts are real. Oh, they're so gorgeous. I could just... Well, thank you. What I would do to those. Now, what do they have to do to... I mean, what, where is this beach that they took you to? You know what? They took me straight to Zuma Beach. And well, I'm just wondering. I mean, how do you not have a riot if you get her naked on the beach? Let's talk about her breasts. Yeah, how do you not have a riot? How do you stand well, out there naked? They keep the security, keeps everyone back. And But the ne next day... Actually, I, we were shooting that, and I hadn't told my parents yet. And I was planning on telling them when it came out. But mm. the next day, we got a call from hard copy saying we just want to let you know that we have footage of Marlies on the beach oh boy and we're airing it tonight so I said okay just let me call my mom real quick you look real horny during this shoot oh. were you do you get do you get sexually excited while they're shooting you naked well you know you have to feel sexy yeah you look like sexy, you want it so, so bad <laughs> do you uh do you do you play with yourself at all before you uh no, oh, no. Howard. Well, I mean do you, do you think about guys or something or chicks she or has whatever? an imagination obviously do you touch an actress, yourself no. Do you, no no do man you, you don't have any did you and my layout, I've got butt shots. Do you get butt shots? You know in there? what? I yeah. have a butt shot in there. A you very do? small you do? one, thank really? goodness. Yes, you do have a small butt. I'm, and I didn't even know he was doing that either because I kept he was doing shots of me running towards him and then I would run back uh -huh. to start over again. And he, and was he so snapped shooting. that little sneaker snapped a You know, the, ca the camera loves <laughs> your vagina. Yes. It really does. Oh, it looks so beautiful. It, it does. <laughs> it does. I mean, every shot you show your vagina, right? Howard, what's not to love? And it's beautiful. I love you. I said, I'm going to tell you, I love you. I love you. I love you too. I, do, I mean, I'm I'm kidding. I'm in love with you. I think you have a great personality. Oh, thank you. And I think you're sweet. And I I'm in love with you. Sweet. I'm in love with you. I fell in love with you during the commercial. <laughs> you know, I don't think people realize how adorable you are in person. Exactly. Robin doesn't realize <laughs> it. Nobody Everybody has oh. ever realized right. it. Nobody realizes it. <laughs> you're the first person, actually. <laughs> no, right. no one. No By the one way, ever. it's undiscovered. Well, it adorability. I just want everyone to know. Thank you. Are you Polish? No. Uh, <laughs> Tracy Bingham is half Afro-American, part Cherokee, and part Italian. She was attending Harvard when she left for Hollywood. <laughs> true? Very true. Yep. yep. So you don't think she this... She dropped out of Harvard? She dropped out of Harvard. I was just... I was taking classes there, psychology. Uh-huh. And, well, Harvard was right down the street from, from my, my family's home. Uh -huh. uh -huh. <laughs> I mean, were, were you enrolled in Harvard? <laughs> yeah, wait a second. She just dropped by. Were you a student at Harvard, or, was, you, or did you just kind of audit some classes? I was taking classes. But were you accepted into Harvard? Yes. Oh, you were. Out of yes. high school, you applied to Harvard, and you yes. got accepted. Yes. Really? Wow. What were your SAT? Is that Harvard TV repair school? in Newark or Harvard <laughs> University? Howard, her bio goes to great lengths to show how smart she is because it also mentions that she's got six brothers and sisters and they all attended Ivy League schools. Well, they, yeah. Hey, look at David Brenner getting wow. interested. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> now I'm getting seven aroused. brothers and sisters <laughs> and nobody I get aroused by education. I think, you're, I think I'm in love with you. <laughs> Wait a minute. 
it. You were just in love here. Oh, so you're in love with me now? Yeah, I'm I, in love I with you. I agree. First of all, during you the now. commercials, I fell in love with you. <laughs> you're, just, you're so sexy. And Tracy, uh, so you should yeah. be good at Jeopardy. Yeah, see, here I you go. You're putting me up with another know. ringer. Oh. All right, let me ask you something. Oh. Seriously, let me ask you something. Nobody give her a hint. You're What's the square root of 225? I don't know that. That's what I mean. How could she be in Harvard? I don't know that. But there's a lot of things I don't know. What's the square root? What's the square root of 81? 81. God. God? (laughs) No help. No help. No help. No help. No help. No, seriously. No help. Tracy, what is the square root of 81? Nine. What? Please. I don't know. Nine? I don't yeah. know. That's right, yeah. yeah. I'm sorry. How could you be in Harvard just, and not know that? Well, just because I'm nervous, Howard, and I, I thought, you know, for this Jeopardy game... What's two plus two? No math <laughs> questions. <laughs> That's what the math... Oh, gee. No, seriously. Let me ask you a couple of questions if you went to Harvard. Let me think of some questions. You can, you can ask me some questions, but you know what? I Go right ahead. What are you saying? They're asking me Here's beforehand. One. All right, what's the, the capital of New York? New York? Yeah. <laughs> what's the capital of New York? <laughs> I got a chance today. <laughs> Wait a second. I didn't Seriously, what, what is the capital of New York? Would it be New Jersey? Would it be New York? What, New Jersey? Is, is your answer New Jersey? <laughs> Very good. <laughs> Is your answer New Jersey? No. no? Oh, no. I think because that's it. You are absolutely right. Capital of New York is New Jersey. Of course, Howard. What is H2O? Water. Right. Okay. Very good. Very, Very good. good. All right. Maybe that you did go good. to Harvard. No, Howard. I, just, I, just, I was worried because before when we were going to do this, um, we were asked... Asked who we thought was going to win this, and I thought Robin would because Robin is very intelligent. Very she knows intelligent. Everything. She didn't go to Harvard. Harvard, but she didn't go. But there's there's a lot there's a lot of of on the show. You you you've got it all down. Tracy, <laughs> what is the center of the solar system? The center of the solar system? Yeah. Newark. <laughs> no, 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 no hints. No hints. No hints. Yeah, oh. I got an answer. No I hints. Know, I just say I am. <laughs> what is the center of the solar system? Go ahead. Would it be the sun, would it be the moon, or would it be the earth? Yeah, yeah, I'm asking you. <laughs> is it multiple choice? <laughs> yeah, is it a multiple no, choice? No, no, it isn't. You went to Harvard, huh? Marlies, why don't you answer? <laughs> wow. Do you know Robin? Oh, sure. <laughs> <laughs> now, hold on, let me... Uh, do you know Howard? Uh, yeah, I do know the answer. What is it? Sun. <laughs> okay. so That's what I was going to say. He asked the question. Of course By the way, the Harvard is really mad at you right <laughs> now. <laughs> yeah, Phil, you're on the air. Go ahead. Yeah, you know, Howard, I, you know, I've seen Tracy. Tr- Tracy, don't take this the wrong way, but uh-huh. I think Tracy might be a tranny. What's a, a tranny? tranny? Well, you know, like, oh, what do you mean, like no. a man? Like, formally a man? No. Like, a, what? Wait, a what? A what? transvestite? Don't take this the oh, really? yeah, let me explain myself because okay. I think the I think a lot of these trannies are really hot. <laughs> <laughs> you kind of got some of the features that kind of lead you to believe that. Like oh, really? What? Why? What about me? <laughs> You're saying that she used to be a man? <laughs> She's a petite girl. What she are you is the hottest about? chick I've ever seen. I I did, I, did I say she wasn't hot? The hell's but wrong why would you say that? Why would you think that? What about me? What are these features? Well,. I think he's lying. The, the, I don't the think he's The big giveaway or the big hands. He's big a, hands. Oh, I've got big beautiful hands. hands. I she's got was gorgeous a hand hands. She was yeah. a hand model. Her hands are gorgeous. Yeah. She's got big hands, and her face is slightly masculine. Not oh. like, not oh. like, you know, he doesn't have this like a... This is a gay guy. This guy's a gay guy. This guy's a lesbian. You're out of your mind. What? This guy's a lesbian. You're a lesbian. This guy's a lesbian. Get out of here. I don't think you've really seen Tracy. Yeah, I don't think you've seen... I don't think you got it right. That is so funny. You've seen someone else. Have you ever been accused of being a man before? No, I think that's really funny. You went out with Denzel Washington? Is that true? No, I never went out with Denzel. Oh, He's okay. gorgeous. Right. I've never went out with him. All right, let's get to the game. Hey, Howard, Tracy really has an unfair advantage because she is a Harvard that's person. That's right. Wait, and so give her penalty points. Right. <laughs> Howard, Tracy also is a veteran of a lot of other game shows. Like what? $20,000 Pyramid. Is that right? Wheel of Fortune. Oh, come and, on. and Pictionary. Really? Oh. Really? Yeah. Oh, see, now this oh. is a game oh, this show is rigged. expert. I'm telling you, play to live. And, Mar- and Marlise has also done Wheel, but she didn't, oh. do, she didn't do very well. <laughs> oh. I needed right. it to spin. Tracy and Marlise, you count as one person. That's not fair. This is how no I'm getting you in shape none. for the game. Oh, good. I'm putting you up against Harvard girls. <laughs> Robin Quivers, of course, we all know who she is. David yes. Brenner, an old friend of the show, we all know who he is. Did you go to Harvard? I was there. Right. You picked <laughs> up girls. Very nice. We visited Cambridge, <laughs> Massachusetts. Nice. Yes, Our categories are science, entertainment, sports, and potpourri. You could see their money values, 100, 200, 300, 400, 500. Wow. And I'm going to allow the, the uh, Baywatch girls Certainly. to pick the first category because they are very beautiful. Beautiful. And beautiful women get my attention every time. Thank you, Howard. That was very complimentary to me. You are a guy, as far as I'm concerned, and you will get no advantage. Yeah. Go ahead. Okay. What? We'd like to go with entertainment. Entertainment. 
entertainment. That's smart because you are in the entertainment business for $100. Might be smart, might be really dumb. All right, here we go. Here is your question. Remember to buzz in and answer in answer form. Or question form. Whatever. Okay, yeah, right. What am I thinking? Okay. Yes, that's your buzzer. Five. You can buzz it too? You can buzz. Whoever, Gary, watch who buzzes. Everybody buzzes in. Okay. Five, six, or seven. The number of seconds that would elapse before the tape self destructed on Mission Impossible. Robin. I think that would be five. Uh, what is five seconds? That is correct, and that's $100 on the board for Robin. Trevor's Robin, you have control of the board. Uh huh. David Brenner going, what kind of question is that? Uh, geez, let's take science for 100. Science for 100. Here we go. The male or the female? The mosquito that draws blood. David, David Brenner. What kind of buzz was that for me? <laughs> <laughs> That's a fart. The, uh, the uh, male mosquito does not bite people, only the female, so therefore it's a female. So what, what is a female? That is correct. Female? What is the female? Wow. By the way, our Baywatch girls have not buzzed in yet. <laughs> Wait, does mine even work? I don't have the Let buzzer. me see if it works. Test it. Yes, it works. Yes, it works. Well, okay, great. David, I go ahead. Excuse, I have no buzzer. Okay, uh, let's take potpourri. Potpourri? Potpourri. <laughs> potpourri. For how much? For 100 uh, No, let's take potpourri for $400. Okay, oh. here we go. Well. Are you ready? Yes. Sure. Yeah. Baywatch girls, are you ready? Yes. <laughs> right. Lee Harvey Oswald, John Kennedy, and Jack Ruby all died here. Robin. And Robin. Oh. Where is Dallas? Where is Dallas, or what is Dallas? Very nice. And Robin, you have five hundred dollars. David Thank Brenner. You very much. And Baywatch <laughs> girls have nothing. Yeah. What's with the Baywatch girls? I don't know. I hit my. We're letting Robin win. She locked no, no, no. you out. Oh, thanks a lot. <laughs> it's supposed to give her practice, so we Baywatch have to girls. Have a big deal. We're, we're going to be we're going to be doing the Bally's commercial later. <laughs> Who cares that she has? Okay, let's uh, go back to. Oh, I'm still controlling Robin the Quivers. That's, That's right. right. Uh, give me science for two hundred. You want science for two hundred? Okay. Unlike humans, rats are unable to do this when they eat poison. Unlike humans, rats are unable to do this when they eat poison. David Brenner? Uh, what, what animal can't vomit? That's correct. What is vomit? That is correct. I thought I buzzed in before him. Well, you did. You did. <laughs> oh, you did? Well, you and Dallas. Well, she didn't, Howard. She didn't? David was in first. David was in first. Right, okay. Right. Well, I buzzed in on the Dallas. What is it? Yeah. Quiet. I'm just going to start guessing. I think these uh, Baywatch girls skipped their SATs and went to the beach. <laughs> that I'm saying. Come on, girls. Get in there. You got right, the uh, David, Harvard education. Okay. David I'm Brown. going to take science for $300. Okay. Trini... Trotu Luen is better known as this explosive. Trini, Trini Trotu Luen. Trini Trotu Luen. Up there's Marlies. I'm guessing TNT. That's correct. Oh, yeah. On the board with 300. Woo. Come here, I'll give you a big kiss. <laughs> I'll save up all my kisses. All right, baby. Very good. All right, Marlies, you control the board. Our Baywatch beauty. <laughs> I love a smart broad. Okay. Go ahead. I want entertainment for 300. Smart. You are in that business. Entertainment for 300. This comedian's theme song is Thanks for the Memories. And there's Robin Quivers. Who is what? Bob what? Hope? <laughs> she knows she, she, what's going on, David, is she's buzzing in before you. She's locking you out. Yeah, right. he's getting upset because he's not buzzing in fast <laughs> enough. Right. Who is Bob Hope? That is correct, Robin. Go ahead, Robin Quivers. You're on the board. I think I want I want her buzzer. I want Tracy and Marlise. Yeah. <laughs> We're trying. Let's take sports for 100. Okay, and please call me Alex. Sports for 100. The country that has won the most Olympic gold medals for hockey. Robin Quivers. What is Russia? Wrong. Let's go to Marlise. What is Canada? Canada. Canada. <laughs> Robin, you're minus 100, and Marlise and Tracy go up another $100, and girls, you control the board. All righty, then. Come on, let me hey, congratulate you. Let me fill your ass. scores. We don't know where we're playing here. <laughs> Robin has 700, David has 300, <laughs> Baywatch has 400. Oh, there it is. Okay. Ba hey, David, Baywatch what? is beating you. <laughs> <laughs> let me tell you something. Baywatch can beat me any night of the You're not kidding. Go ahead, Baywatch. We would like potpourri for 300, Alex. The Baywatch girls are really making their move now with potpourri for 300. And thanks for calling me Alex. <laughs> Mixing gin and vermouth gives you this drink. Now, Robin. Robin Quivers. What is a martini? That is correct. <laughs> Girls, I thought you'd have that one. We're not buzzing quick enough. I'll say. <laughs> David, David's, yeah, David's getting really, he thinks we set him up. But you yeah, have to, because I keep no, you buzzing. Gotta buzz again, let me see if it works. Yeah, it works. But it's a getting, wait, wait, look at the delay. Listen, listen, listen. 
It's right it's on. Not, that delay the is light. when it's she jumps That's in. That's the light going on. The, the, the light goes on for us. The sound is delayed. But believe me, your light's going on, David, because you buzzed in once already. I'm God, not being out smart. I'm Robin Quivers has control of the board. Go ahead. Robin with 1,000 points. Go ahead. Okay. All right. Let's see. Robin has 1,000. David has 300. Now, let's take sports for 200. Sports for 200. Nope. 200 is gone, isn't it? Yeah. No. Oh, I'm sorry. Okay. <laughs> Alex is confused. Alex. Sports for 200. This baseball legend was known as the Yankee Clipper. David Brenner. The Yankee Clipper. Uh, who was Joe DiMaggio? That is correct. For $200. Go ahead. You control the board. Okay. <laughs> See, your buzzer works. Okay. Let's take science for 400 Science for 400 The frequent passage of watery feces is a sign of this condition. <laughs> Robin, Qu uh, Robin Quivers. What is diarrhea? That is correct. For $400, Robin Quivers in the lead now. Very, very dominant lead for uh, 1400 David Brenner with 500 Baywatch Cross with 400 David Brenner, go ahead. I, I just want to say I am so glad I did not know the answer to that. I know. Robin Quivers, go ahead. She was a nurse. Go ahead. I'm going to take uh, science for 500 Science for 500 Number of wings on a flea. Number of wings on a flea. Uh, I see Tra Tracy. Um... Oh, what is two? What say again? Two. Two? Yes. That is wrong. You just cost 500 <laughs> points to the Baywatch team. David, David Brenner. Buzzer. What is nothing? That is correct. Zero oh, on a flea. flea. Yeah. I thought you said fly. A no. flea. Oh, you said flea. I'm sorry. Ah, oh, come we on. We need to do it over. Do it over. Your I would like oh. to say we that I have never seen a flea. So. You have never seen a flea? <laughs> I know. I don't know. Let me I check. I am lucky. I, I have them. <laughs> I never thought there would be a so benefit. so that gives him an unfair advantage. David Brenner has 1,000. Robin Quivers has 1,400. And Baywatch has minus 100. And let's go with... 500 David right. Brenner. Okay. Sorry, uh, Merlis. Let's take, <laughs> I let's didn't hear take you. sports for 300. Sports for 300 points. No more baseball. This U.S. Senator once played for the New York Knicks. Robin Quivers. Oh. Oh, God. <laughs> Wait a minute, I got it. Go. Wait a minute. Uh, David Brenner. Time's up. Sorry. Uh, who was Bill Bradley? Yes. That is correct. Darn it. It just it came in and out and in and out. I buzzed in and out. Doesn't matter. <laughs> oh, now she's... Oh, David Brenner. Now she says she has buzzer problems. <laughs> Robin Quivers has 1,100. <laughs> David Brenner takes the lead with 1,300. Right. Baywatch at minus 100. Let's go, David Brenner. Entertainment for 200 bucks. Entertainment for 200 bucks. Robin, I try to stall as long as I could. <laughs> no, no, no. you got to be fair, no. Alex. I'm being fair. She portrayed... Michael Corleone's second wife in The Godfather. She portrayed Michael Corleone's second wife in The Godfather. Ooh. Oh! Robin Quivers. Who is Diane Keaton? That is correct for 200. <laughs> you only have one wife. Robin Quivers goes. She married this young Italian girl. She got blew up oh, in the car. She got blown up in the car. Threw me off the that's correct. Go ahead, good. Robin. Yeah. You go. Very good, Robin. Okay, let's I'm see. I knew Robin was going to win this. David Brenner. for four hundred dollars. All right, David Brenner and Robin tied at thirteen hundred right. points. This song, the song written by Mildred and Patty Hill, is the most often sung at parties. Robin Quivers. What oh. is Happy Birthday? Oh. That's correct. Oh. Happy Birthday to you. Oh. Happy Birthday to you. I had it. I never knew. David Brenner, you're getting beaten by girls. I'm getting beaten by my thumb. All right, let's keep going. My thumb. Robin Quivers, you have the, the lead. I have the lead. 1,700 points. Board. I will take uh, the, 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 the potpourri for 100. Potpourri for 100 points. Why am I yelling? <laughs> you ready? We need 100 The points. Illinois yeah. town that was Superman's boyhood home. Robin. Oh, darn. What <laughs> is... Oh... Oh. Sorry, Alex. All right, I'm sorry. Uh, anybody else? What, what is one guess? Smallville. Oh, I could. Smallville. Yeah, I just, Smallville. Oh, I'm so course. sorry. I should have known that. I'm so sorry. I still have control of the board. You do. You sure do. <laughs> yeah. Everybody else is stiffing out. David Brenner is only 300 points behind. Okay, 1,600 to 1,300. Uh, Baywatch girls forget about it. Potpourri for $200. Harvard uh, education doesn't help. Okay, no, here it, it is. Doesn't. It's the hardest bone in the human body. Uh, I know this one. Yeah. <laughs> All right, Marlies, go ahead. What is the skull? I'm sorry, that is not correct, but I'll give you the points. No. no, 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 I can't. Go ahead, anybody else? Robin. Robin. What is the femur? I'm so sorry. Mm. I'm so sorry. I'm so, so terribly sorry. Oh, Are we talking about males or females? I'm <laughs> talking about both. David Brenner, do you need a guess? Uh, just a guess. Do I lose points if I guess? Yes. yes. So I don't, don't want to guess. Okay. What oh, is the jawbone? Oh, the jawbone. That's jawbone. 200 jawbone. points deducted. Yeah. All right. I always get their jaw broken. Robin Quiver still That's has control question. of the board, though. <laughs> okay. 
I will take <laughs> entertainment for 500. Entertainment for 500. The hardest okay. bone in my yeah, body is in my it. pants. <laughs> <laughs> he was the overweight Cartwright brother on the Ponderosa. Robin Quivers. Who was Haas or Dan Blocker? That is correct. Who was Haas or Dan Blocker is correct. <laughs> That's a big 500 points for you, and you've got the lead with 1,900. David Brenner with 1,300. Baywatch Girls minus 300. Ooh. How about some more recent entertainment? <laughs> By the way, <laughs> star of Private Park. Whoever has the lowest score at the end of the game has to make love to me. Oh. <laughs> well, we're Can I buzz ahead of time? <laughs> yeah, right. I'm going to start buzzing right Robin now. Quivers. Uh, it's hard go. to believe that Tracy was in Harvard, isn't it? <laughs> All right, here's I know. I can't get any of these answers. Me All right. I'll give you 500 I'm points right now if you can tell me where Harvard is. <laughs> <laughs> okay, here we go. Robin, go uh, ahead. Potpourri for 500, Alex. Potpourri for 500. This is a very big question. I hope everyone is paying attention. Our Hooters girl doing very well. <laughs> Plants or animals? What barnacles are? Robin Quivers. Uh, uh, they are plants. What are plants? Mm, so sorry. No. Uh, <laughs> David Brenner buzzed in next. You buzzed. David what? did. David buzzed in. You did buzz? Yeah. Go ahead and answer. <laughs> what, what was the question? <laughs> what, what, are, what are what plants? Plants or animals? What, what barnacles plants? are? Yeah, well, what, what, what are plants? <laughs> Wrong. Go ahead, Brace Watch what Girls. What are animals? <laughs> what are animals is right. <laughs> 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 I don't care what you meant. <laughs> the Baywatch girls are on the map. All right. I'm here. You said the wrong answer. I, said, what are plants? I thought you meant what did she say? So I said, what are plants? I know the answer is animals. She said plants. Robin, 1,400. David Brenner, 800. Baywatch girls, 200. I didn't know the one left over was the answer. <laughs> Baywatch girls, you have control of the board. Okay, oh, my God. Like sports we'll be going for sports. <laughs> you, got, you got bamboozled. Could we end the game now and just do final oh. No, no, no. The Baywatch girls are going to come up. request what? some football questions? Go ahead. Um, sports for 500. Sports for 500. They are the team that won the very first Super Bowl. That would be Kirby. Robin, and the answer is who are the Green Bay Packers? That's correct. <laughs> you wanted a football question. You got it. <laughs> And now your final question in the sports category. Listen, uh, David, you're a man. You should be able to get this. (laughs) This sport, which is featured in the film Bang the Drum Slowly. David Brenner. Uh, What is baseball? That is correct. 400. All right. At the end of our match here, we see 1,900 for Robin Quivers, 1,200 for David Brenner, 200 for Baywatch. And what I'll do is ask you a final Jeopardy question. What is the category? The category is... (laughs) <laughs> there is no category. What's the difference? <laughs> they always tell you the category. All right. uh, the category uh, movies. is... Movies. Movies. All right. It is? Yeah. Oh, it is. The final category is movies. Okay. Write down your uh, wagers based on movies. Remember what you have. Baywatch Girls, you can bet up to $200. The no, loser... Bet what we don't have? Nope. No. <laughs> and the loser has to take off all their clothes. Yeah. <laughs> just keep that in mind when you're wagering. Okay. I already did that for you right in front of you. Wait a minute. No, you didn't. I want the real thing. (laughs) I don't want some goddamn picture. I hope David loses. (laughs) Oh, stop it. Then he has to take off his clothes. We have to bet right now? Yeah, just put down the amount you want to bet. All right, everybody wrote down how much they're going to wager? Okay, all right. Here is your final question. And we have to write our answers or are we saying them out loud? Well, we can see each other's answers. What is this? No, we'll we'll cover it up. That's the I fun happen, of it. I like in just school. happen to be next to Robin. Jeez. All right, here we go. Remember those nerds in school that would cover yeah, up their really? hand? They put their hand well, over put it. your hand over it. Remember those nerds that did that? Yeah, that was me. That was Stan. All right, here we go. <laughs> well, this is a stupid way to do this. Just write it down. Oh, go on. I'd like you to notice that none of the Baywatch girls have made a single complaint. Because you have <laughs> game. I'm not even sure you know we're playing again. <laughs> here we go. You know, so we, I wanted to make my predi- prediction come true that Robin would win this. Uh, Hey, Howard, can yeah. I just, can you I know just... what's great about Baywatch Girls? You see, the questions they could answer are like girl questions. <laughs> like stuff like, uh, okay, Kate Spade designs what? Do you know? Kate Spade. Kate Spade designs um, shoes. Shoes and handbags, that's right. Okay. See? You see how they would see? win? <laughs> Rodeo yeah. Drive is in what town? <laughs> Beverly Hills. See, look at them. <laughs> what does a good implant job cost? I have no idea. You guys know. <laughs> All right. Uh, Would you get to the final Jeopardy? No, wait a second. <laughs> I want to get out Watch this. Watch how good they are. <laughs> Monostat 7 and Fenstat are used to do what? They're yeast They're infection yeast creams. Infection. Yeast infection creams. You see, you see how they would win? I didn't know one of them. But there's also I know. a three-day treatment. Yeah, exactly. 
Nikki, Tyler, Nikki Taylor is a spokesmodel for what cosmetics company? Oh, Covergirl. Cover Girl. That's correct. <laughs> See, look at that. They could be your asses. <laughs> Thank goodness they didn't ask us these questions. Clearasil is used to cure what? Acne. Right, exactly. <laughs> what is Donna Car Karen famous for? Clothing. Clothing. Right. DKNY. Carl Lagerfeld is a designer for what label? Uh, uh, what, what label? Uh, Lagerfeld. Yeah, and Bill Chanel? Yep. Uh, Chanel. Right. Um, I knew that one. You did? <laughs> Who's the new host of House of Style? Do you know? Um, it's not oh. Cindy Crawford. Rebecca? It's, oh, it's a... Uh, Rebecca Romain. Yeah. yeah. In order to prevent yeast infection after sex, you should what? Douche. Oh. Yep. You, know you have to oh. urinate. Yep. Urinate. 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 The girls know. The girls know. <laughs> or kill after. You're a douche. That's what yeah, I'm a douche. <laughs> David would douche. I'm a douche. Or you just yeah. make sure that it's with a sanitary man. Right. <laughs> right. All right. Here we go. All right. See, All right that's what the is point. the final Jeopardy right. question? <laughs> These girls aren't dumb. They just you know about You shouldn't have to worry stuff. about yeast infections when you're having sex with someone. Exactly. <laughs> yeah, there's a lot of things you have to worry about in sex that you shouldn't have. All right. Here is your final Jeopardy question. This don't blurt out the answer. This science fiction film was based on Arthur C. Clarke's novel entitled Sentinel. Sentinel. Write down your answer. Don't let anybody look. This science fiction film was based on Arthur C. Clarke's novel entitled Sentinel. Ooh. David Brenner looks worried. Yes. Robin Quivers looks worried. The Baywatch beauties, though, seem to have the answer. All right. Science fiction film. They think the oh, answer is barbed oh, wait wire. A wait a minute, wait a minute. <laughs> you guys are oh. laughing at us over there. <laughs> I, I don't know. Oh, I know the name. I can't think of the name of the Just moment. write it down. Oh, don't wait, blurt wait, it wait, out. Wait a minute. I'm so stupid if we're wrong. <laughs> <laughs> oh, write down know. anything. All right. This is to help Robin Quivers out. He's preparing for an actual Jeopardy appearance. Our Baywatch beauties are scribbling. David Brenner scribbling. Robin Quivers okay. scribbling. All right. Uh, first, we're going to go to the Baywatch beauties. What did you wager, first of all? Oh, don't even tell me. Tell me your answer, first of all. Uh, well, the only movie that we have on our minds is Private Parts. Private Parts is not based on <laughs> Sentinel. How much did you wager? We wagered. 200. We wagered it all, baby. <laughs> wow. That will bring you down Cut. to zero. We went for broke. You did. Yeah. Uh, That's a good guess. I'm going to kiss you guys. I feel so bad. <laughs> I'm going to go next to uh, David Brenner, who's sitting with $1,200. Okay. And uh, what did you? Well, what is your answer, first of all? Uh, my answer is I couldn't think of the name of the movie, so I put Lost World 1, the first one about the dinosaurs. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. And how much did you wager? Seven cents. Really? Seven cents? No. How much? 750 cash U.S. All right. 750 cash U.S. So that's trouble. 750. No, you're not. Robin, what's, uh, hey, well, Tracy should know this. What's uh, 1,200 minus 750? 1,200 minus 750? Yeah. Go ahead. Um, oh, you went to Harvard. Wait, I know. wait, wait, wait. Oh, dear. <laughs> we don't have let, that long. Yeah, let her think about it. Go ahead. Come on. Eight million. <laughs> How much? What? Four. What? Say again. Say it. You got it. I'm sorry. Three, 450. 450? Close enough. Wait, what did right, you Robin? say? Wait, what did you say? I don't know. That's right. 450 is right. Right. She's okay. right. She went to Harvard. Howard, you're making me nervous. Robin, what is your... Uh... I did not know the answer to this, Alec. And what did you... I wrote, what is alien? What is... 2001 A Space Odyssey. Uh, oh. I'm so sorry. So how much did you wager? Wait a minute. What did I you wager? I wagered all 1900. So Whoa. David Brenner wins. Whoa. David Brenner won. Whoa. Thank you. <laughs> Look how happy he is. <laughs> Baywatch Beauties, you came in with zero. Robin, zero. And David Brenner at 450. Very David so Brenner, you are the big winner. What does he win? Uh, he, wins he wins nothing but all the losers, including Robin, have to make out with me and let me fondle them. That's why I won. Once again, man has conquered. <laughs> men, 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 men. Ah, be quiet. 2001 A Space Odyssey. I hated the film. You did. <laughs> Never watched it. So I don't right. You didn't even know the answer and you bet everything. I know. That's, that's but I did. On the edge, to man. Beat me. <laughs> well, let me tell you something, Robin. You got to practice. I'm gonna get you some more practice. Session. Okay. You lost to David. No, Brenner. she was good. Uh, uh, can I make a comment on that? this? Don't I kiss don't her ass. I don't, don't do this to her. This. No, I got to get her in shape. It's the money management. <laughs> <laughs> See, you think about it. I needed money to win, so if she just bet a hundred, you know what? Right. I, originally, you know what I, mean? I originally wrote Look, you know, down that she would have won it. Wrong. Robin, Robin, you bet right because you were banking on a your knowledge, and also if he had bet a lot of 
money, that's right. he would have won. That's why I changed it. Don't listen to him. I'm yeah. your coach. Hey, Howard, <laughs> what is it? I'll tell you one thing. I learned a valuable lesson today because, you know, I look at people's bios and I believe everything in it. Yes. And I, when I saw that Tracy went to Harvard, I go, oh, the game is ruined. Yeah. yeah but, but Tracy. <laughs> no, I just, I, I paused it there and I didn't fit it. If you went to Harvard. Harvard. Hey, if she went to Harvard, I'm Einstein. Exactly. <laughs> that's all I got to say. What classes, University. what classes did you take at Harvard? Seriously. You went to Georgetown. Psychology. Uh, you did take psychology? Wait a second. What were your SATs? They were they were they were weren't you know excellent but they were I mean they weren't were they, they weren't bad. But you applied to Harvard and, and wrote you the essay in? and everything. She Maybe because she's have gone she, and talked to somebody. Yeah, on yeah they must have taken a look at her <laughs> and put her in. There's something going on here. She went to Harvard but not in the regular way. Like you, Harvard you Beauty School. And wrote an essay. I didn't I didn't dorm there. I just I, I took but, classes but, there. But answer the question: Did you apply and write an essay? You know you don't get into Harvard without writing an essay. Did you do that? Did yeah, you, I did all of that. Maybe you visited Harvard. <laughs> Are you oh, sure it was I Harvard? Didn't, I didn't. I didn't. I didn't. I didn't do very well. I didn't finish. <laughs> obviously. I'm not sure you started. Okay, girls, you have to make yes. out with me now because you lost. <laughs> Robin Quivers, congratulations on an almost win. <laughs> girls. That was great. That was great. Oh, so fun. I knew it'd be fun, but I was surprised at how much fun it was. Yeah, is that a good time? Yeah. Great. Right. Howard is the best. You're not upset that you lost? No. I, no. I knew what we, well, we were told not to win. We had to make Robin look exactly. good. Exactly. Oh, but really? you lost. We knew all the answers, so, but, yeah. you know. You, you, <laughs> Well, congratulations, you won. You're winner here. Thanks. So now I can I can leave with no prize. Is that the idea? Absolutely I get no absolutely prize. nothing for this. We don't donate any money to charity. Nothing. Ever. Nothing. <laughs> not a chick. Get, not a piece anything. of gum. Nothing. A tuna. To a tuna get, special. Get, tuna melt. Sure. A milkshake. Nothing. Nothing. Nothing at all. Um, wow. Well, except the except that except the fact that, that you I was, know you I was won. A, I was the smartest of four persons. Right. Exactly. <laughs> 